Hey there, posture guys and gals, and welcome to my screen. Now, for those of you that are a bit of detective types, you might notice one or two different things here on the home page. Number one being this orange bar here. And, you know, some of you might be thinking, well, that orange bar was there before, and you'd be right, but it was a place to sign up to receive the kick butt list of self optimization apps, which hopefully you've done so by now, because now it's changed up here. Uh, as you can see, I pose the question Could your breathing be contributing to your chronic pain? poor posture, and subpar performance, click here to find out. And we're going to go through there in just a little bit. But the reason that's there is because yesterday I put together this post called Optimize Your Breathing to Relieve Your Pain, Realign Your Posture, and Improve Your Performance. So you can probably guess that uh, the answer to the question in the orange bar is yes. And I would say that in my experience, nine times out of ten, no matter what the person coming to me for uh, for help with, knee pain, back pain, shoulder pain, arthritis, doesn't really matter the symptom. Nine times out of 10, they have poor breathing patterns or poor breathing mechanics. So this is something that is huge. It's a big common denominator amongst people uh, in chronic pain or with poor posture or subpar performance. So if you click here, on click here to find out, it will actually take you to a registration page. There's that guy. Um, it'll take you to a registration page for the Optimize Your Breathing Hangout, which is going to be this coming Saturday, June 28th, 2014. And you can select two times here 9 a.m. Pacific Standard Time or 11 a.m. Pacific Standard Time for those of you that may want to sleep in or, you know, had a. Uh, <laughs> had a uh, long Friday night, so to speak. But I definitely recommend you sign up and you be there live because we're going to be going over all kinds of stuff, as including how to become aware of your breathing, how to modify it and change it, uh, some self myofascial release techniques you can do to clear up certain obstacles or barriers you might have in your body. I'm talking like muscle and soft tissue uh, adhesions, uh, as well as some exercises to link uh, parts of your body back up so that you can engage your diaphragm, your primary breathing muscle, and then your secondary breathing muscles up in your chest, shoulders, and neck can relax. So this is huge. You know, I would say out of the seven foundations of health, those being breathing, hydration, sleep, nutrition, stress, movement, and exercise, breathing is definitely the most important. So you're definitely going to want to be there. So like I said, pick the time that works best for you, put your name, email, and then register, and I'll see you inside. All right, anyways, thanks for watching today, and I look forward to seeing you inside the Hangout. Until then, take care and keep moving.